Let us see how the sophisticated searches that Curator introduced in 723 can help us when we are performing some investigation. So in here we are looking at this particular offense, unauthorized car holder user alert, you know, one event. Let's, let's look at the data that we have in there. So we click there, we see that one event, hmm, Guardium is the one telling us that. That's important because Guardian finds stuff that is relevant. So we have I source IP, the source IP, but Curator, as usual, grabs the username. But who is this guy? US0Z671. Well, we have now the capability of doing some searches. So let's start building the, the query. So we do a select, and uh, we can, you know, start by let's select everything uh, from events and uh, where the username is equal to that username that was uh, US uh, 0C671 Zero six seventy one. Let's see if that's the one. And we click search. And what do we get? We don't get anything. Well, the, the default search is for five minutes, so maybe I need to specify for the last uh, 24 hours, for example. 24 hours. Let me use more the look ahead to help me build this. So I click here. And yep, there we have two events of those of that. But again, um, the objective in here is to find out who is the actual uh, user. So I can, instead of getting everything in here, I can just uh, reduce this to username. So I want to look at the username. Let me test this out very quickly. And uh, yep, that's what I got. I have those two events. But what I want to do it's actually to put the actual name of the person. And we do have a reference map that given a username, is a many to one username enters, ping, give me the actual name of the person. And I'm gonna paste here that construct that we have used in previous videos. And this is saying, well, from the reference map called global ID mapping that we have seen before, entering this username that we got, that US whatever, give me the global username. and. We click here and we have some uh, small error in here. And sure enough, we need to separate those uh, components. And here we got, we forgot that comma. And now whether we put the sentence correctly, we, we got that is Nathan Taylor, the guy that was actually uh, performing uh, that particular uh, action. So.